Good day. Last summer I blogged about gun control. And why I blogged about gun control? This was right after the Aurora movie theater shooting where 12 innocent lives were lost. I was disgusted. I had said earlier we need to have an amendment change to our Constitution for gun control. I am sure back in 1791 when Madison and Jefferson wrote the Constitution that they did not have any idea what was going to be happening in our world in 2012. And then again, this weekend it strikes again catastrophe. Joe Van Belcher, one of the great Kansas City chief football players and supposedly a great guy lost it shot his girlfriend to death and went to the Kansas City Chiefs stadium and in front of his coach killed himself what is it going to take in my blog last summer I talked about Japan and I talked about how they do not have any gun violence. Why? Because guns are forbidden from society. So is ammunition. Guess what? The only thing you can have in Japan is a rifle, a hunting rifle. And in order to get it, you have to take a written test and a psychological exam, and you have to give the police the opportunity to come in your house every 90 days to make sure the gun is kept properly, meaning it's locked up, it's secure, and secure from the ammunition. Now, I heard all kinds of grief last summer when I blogged. People said I was taking away the right to bear arms, something our Constitution states. Well, I want to tell you, we need to change and add an amendment to the Constitution. We need to be safer on the streets where we live. There's too many random shootings. I think they said there's an actual shooting of 36 shootings or deaths a day from random shootings. That is a travesty, and something has to be done. We should forbid handguns in America. It's my opinion, and it's my blog, but it's your voice, and I want to hear from you.